Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. You're with Bethany and today you are in my bathroom with me. We are going to be doing a little demo on the Tarte Timeless Soothing Primer. I just got this at Ulta the other day and I'm super excited to try it out. I haven't opened it yet, haven't tried it, so I want you guys to see how it goes and how this primer works, okay? I've heard a lot of things about it. It's been around for a little while, but I'm just finding out about it. Alta recommended it to me. So let's see how it goes. Stick around and make sure you subscribe to this channel if you have not yet, and make sure to like this video. All right, so let's get into this. Okay guys, welcome to my bathroom. I know it's a little bit of a change from our normal scene where I'm working out with you, but I really wanted to share in this opening of the Tarte Timeless Soothing Primer. Okay, got this at Ulta a couple days ago. I have been searching for a primer that really, really works on my skin. I've been through a slew of primers and so far nothing really is sticking and working well for me. So I went into Ulta and the girl recommended this one. She said it's her favorite and I need to try it out. I'm gonna love it. When I got home, I did some research on it and found out that there was a lot of hype around this stuff um, back a couple years ago. There were like a bunch of TikTok videos and everything that went viral and people saying that it looks like you put a filter on your face because of how great it is. So I wanna try it, because I am all about getting rid of these puff gaps. So right now, no makeup on, I've done my skincare routine, so I'm a little shiny, a little glossy looking, but no makeup on. Um, my eyes are a little puffy today, a lot of allergies going on, a lot of pollen in the air. Um, so let's see what this stuff can do. I hope it works magic on me. Um, and I hope I love it. And then you guys can see how it works. So you can go out and get yourself some too if it actually does work well. And I will give it a chance too. So here we have, I got the bigger container of it. Um, I don't remember exactly how much it was. I think it was about $40, $45. Not the cheapest, but you can get, I think, a smaller container of it. So it's very nice, very pretty. And then, this is how it looks on the inside. All right, so let me tell you also a little bit about this stuff, guys. So it's got vitamin E in it, which is an anti-inflammatory and antioxidant. It's got vitamin C in it, which fights free radical damage and premature signs of aging while brightening the skin. It's got green bee extract, known as its anti Wrinkle and pore minimizing properties. Did I say that right? Let me say it again. So green bean extract, known for its anti-wrinkle and pore minimizing properties. And then mineral pigments, which soothe and soften the skin. So we like all that. We wanna see that happen. So let's go ahead and just put a little bit on our finger here. And I'm just gonna do the one side to start off. I'm gonna put it under my eye where I seem to have a lot of issues. Just kind of runs in my family to have these puffy eyes and then allergies and all that doesn't help. And of course, aging. So let's just smooth it out over there. I actually think though, I do want to put it on my nose as well because that's where a lot of pores are. So let's just get it all in here. We'll kind of do a side-by-side -side, though of the eyes and then I'll put some around the mouth. So let's just get a little bit more in here. Sorry, I know my face looks so scary right now. But just trying to be raw here guys so you can see exactly what's going on. Let's dab that in a little bit. And 
then we're gonna go ahead, we'll get some on the nose. Get it all up in there. It's got a very matte feeling to it, um, kind of like Smashbox. Uh, the, which one is it? The photo. I don't know exactly what one it is. You guys might know what I'm talking about. That one's very matty, but this is not as matty as that. Which I like. It's It gives you a little bit more shine, I think. And then, um, let's get a little bit right in there. Then go ahead. I don't really have, thankfully, deep lines around my mouth. One of the fortunate things going for me. But we're gonna go ahead and we'll put some on the chin as well. Let's just rub it in there, pat it in. Okay. Make sure we got that nose real good. The pores are pretty deep in my nose. So that's one of my areas. And let's hope uh, that, you know, let's even go ahead and put some on the forehead because I'm gonna put my foundation on too after this, but I wanna just do a little look at it. We can see where I put it and where I didn't put it. Okay guys, I just finished putting all the foundation on and what I use if you're interested is Estee Lauder Double Wear um, and I use the Shell Beige color. Um, I'm not super tan usually. I don't really go out in the sun much anymore, uh, but I like to have a complexion that's a little bit on the darker side. So this is perfect color for me and I love Estee Lauder's foundation. So, definitely something to check out. All right, so now here we are, and I don't know if you guys are seeing, but I feel like it really filled in like under my eyes. Yes, I said today I'm kind of puffy, um, but I see that it definitely filled in nicely, not as puffy. Let's get up closer. In the forehead area, I filled in those pores, the nose, not as porous looking. Chin looks really good. I'm gonna give it a thumbs up. So I'm gonna keep using it and see how it goes. And I haven't put anything else on either. So this is just foundation, no setting powder, nothing else. So I just wanted you guys to see it with the Tarte. Again, this is the Tarte Timeless Smoothing Primer and how it works. So I don't know if you guys see a difference or not. Let me know down in the comments. And I hope you liked this video. It's a little bit of a change up, but I wanted to do a little demo of that for you guys. So if you're interested and you're having a hard time finding a good primer, you can come on this journey with me because I have been having a very hard time finding one that works for me. All right, so thanks so much. Again, if you have not subscribed, subscribe to my channel. Give this video a big thumbs up if you like it. Have a great Monday, everybody. And remember, it's never too late to be great. Thanks, guys.